Mountain grown aroma coming. Through. Folgers aroma roasted coffee made from mountain grown beans, richly roasted and finely ground for great waking up aroma. Oh, what that aroma can do, brought a day for me and you. The best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Steve with West Professional Lawn Care. Got my son with me. There. <laughs> so, we are going to Austin today. I work outside of Austin. I live about 30, 45 minutes, depending on where you are, uh, outside of Austin. And uh, that's where my routes are. That's where I live. That's where I have all my customers. But when I started my company last summer, I took everything I I was driving. I was driving to Round Rock, Cedar Park, Austin, all these areas, and um, taking whatever I could get. And uh, so uh, I got rid of all my other customers from last year that were in there, and I kept two because I was thinking they were good customers, and I was thinking I might have made a route in and around that area where they're at, and uh, I never did. I never, never wanted. After I got a lot of customers and it really banged up out here and uh, where I'm at, where I wanna be at, I didn't wanna build a route out there. So <clears throat> today is the last day that I'm going to service those people, the two customers. I told them a month ago, uh, over a month ago, that I was gonna service up to the end of July and uh, that was gonna be the end of it. Um, it's just too far to drive. And when I bid those out, I've only bid them out for $35. When I, I didn't really know what I was doing when I was bidding anything out, so I did it for $35. It's just not worth driving 45 minutes to get to for a $35 lawn and then another 20 minutes to get to the other yard for another $35 and then 45 minutes back out to finish my day out where I live where my rest of my yards are so I'm getting rid of those um it's not worth it they're good people they're good customers I wish they were out here because they're very small yards and they never complain about anything and they always pay on time and um but I just can't drive out there I'm spending too much gas I'm only probably making uh, I don't know a lot less than because of gas and everything like that. So anyway, today's the last day we're going in Austin. Then we're gonna finish the day out. We got some yards to do out in this area where I'm at, and uh, we'll see you guys on the probably the first yard in Austin. I'll show you the two that we are gonna be giving up. almost 50 minutes later because of traffic this is why I'm giving it up because uh, it's a 45 minute drive just to just to uh, just to get out here so yep anyway we're at the first yard of the day the one I'm gonna give up is right behind me and then uh, we're gonna head to the second one that I'm giving up today and this will be the last time we're out here today I know I feel so bad they're such good customers but uh and I love doing this yard because it's real tiny I'm in and out I push mow it because uh, it's so tiny. Um, so it doesn't take nothing to do it, but kind of, kind of excited and sad at the same time. So let's get this day started. to the second house in Austin here my last time doing this one also I'll show you uh, how small the yard is I can do it all by myself I push mow it and uh, I think I think around uh, eight to ten minutes or something like that all right here's the yard it's literally a box right back here nothing to it at all just straight lines up and down and uh, weedy and I just I blow off 
the driveway right here, and that's it. That's, it's a that's pretty all good yard, but it's too long to drive. Yeah, too long, too, too long of a drive for 35 bucks. So we're gonna knock it out right now. That's it. We're done. Like it literally took maybe less than 10 minutes to do that. We're done in Austin. Done in Austin. Last time I'm gonna be here. So we'll see you. All right. Just pulled up to the third and fourth yard of the day. Ready? And uh, it's my uh, yards that I do side by side. This one and that one over there. They're side by side houses. Same person owns both of them. So uh, I take care of both of them. So we're gonna knock these two out. These ones take a little while, but now that I got my son here, it, sh it knocks a little bit of time out. So he'll push mow one house because I can't use the rider on the front or back of one of the houses because it's a brand new sod and uh, the rider would just sink in there. Uh, so I push mow this. I uh, right, put the rider on this one front and back and he push mows the other one front and back. The person so, we're gonna knock it out.